must have two coil terminal, a common terminal, normally open and a normally closed terminal. When the coil is not energized, the common terminal remains connected to the normally closed terminal. But when the coil terminal is energized with the rated voltage, the common terminal changes its position from normally closed to normally open terminal. This is a normal relay. This has two coil terminal. This is the common terminal. This is normally closed and this is normally open terminal. We also have a 6 volt DC supply with a switch. Now we will connect the negative terminal to one of the coil terminals and positive terminal to the common terminal. The common terminal is connected to the normally closed terminal. That means if you switch on the supply, we will get positive 6 volt on the normally closed terminal. Now we will connect the another coil terminal to the normally closed. Now look what happened here. At the moment I switch on the supply, the coils will be energized. As we have energized the coil, the common terminal will shift from normally closed to normally open terminal. And on that moment, the coil terminals will be disconnected from the supply. Because of the coil terminal is now disconnected from the supply, the common terminal will go to its normal position. And as it is connected to the coil terminal, the coil terminal will be energized again. This process will repeat again and again in fraction of seconds. Now we are connecting an LED to the normally open terminal and cathode to the ground. But as the frequency of the oscillation is very high, we will not be able to see the blinking of the LED. To fix this problem, we will connect a capacitor bank parallel to the coil terminal. Now you will be able to see the blinking of the LED. And you can also control the blinking rate by changing the capacitance. As you can see here, when we are removing the capacitors, the pulse rate is also increasing as well. That means the LED is blinking faster. This is how we can blink an LED and control the oscillation with the relay and some capacitors.